Good morning children. Today we are going to make a place value chart. Here are the materials that we need in making the place value chart. First, we have the folder, the scissors, stapler, and the numbers being printed and prepared by me. Are you ready? Cut the folder into a square with a length of 8.5 on each side. have here a square. Now we are going to fold it into two. Set aside first. We are going to cut the place value hundreds, tens, and ones. Okay, we have there an arrow at the bottom. Start cutting it from the bottom. Okay, there it is. Up here, the place value hundreds, tens, and ones. We are going to clip this on our folder. Like this. There you have it. Okay. Next. We are going to cut now number 9. We have there the arrow. Cut it straight. Okay. Set aside first. Next. The eight next, the seven next, we have the six. The five, next we have the four, and we have the three, we have the three. Set aside it. And we have two. We have there the arrow. Follow it and cut it straight. Okay. Set aside. Then we have the one. And then we have the last, which is the zeros. Okay, now we are done. So, okay. We have here now the numbers zeros, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. What we are going to do is to fix it and then 
Okay. Clip it here. Clip it here. There we have it. Okay. Cut the excess paper at the top. Okay, so we have here now. After that, after it is being fixed, we are going to cut the center or we have the we have here the line here. We are going to cut the line here and the, the next line, the middle. Okay, try to... Okay. Okay. Only yeah. Only here at the intersecting line that you are going to cut the uh the line. Okay. Now we have here. Okay. Try to fold it. Okay, now we already have here our place value chart. Okay, for example, I will set 100, 100, 112. So, what is the number in the hundreds place? Correct. One. What about in the tens place? We have one. What about in the ones place? We have two. Okay. There you have it, children. Now, do you know how to make a place value chart already? Good job. Now we are going to have a quiz. I want you to set number 453 on your place value chart. So we have it 453. Okay, in 453. What number is in the place value of ones? What number is in the place value of ones? Very good. It's number three. How about the number in the place value of tens? Very good. We have five. Next, what number is in the place value of hundreds? We have four. Very good. Let's have another number. Let's have 874. So we have eight hundred. 74 Okay Now What number is in the tens place? Yes, it's 7 What about the number in the hundreds place? We have 8 Very good 
How about in the ones place? Good job! It's number four. Now let's have another number. Okay. Let's set 568. 568. Okay, there we have it. Okay. What is the place value of 5? What is the place value of 5? Okay. Oh. Correct. The place value of 5 is hundreds. What about the place value of 8? What about the place value of 8? Correct! It's ones. Now, what about the place value of 6? What is the place value of 6? Very good. It's tens. Okay. Very good, children. Let's have another number. Okay, let's have 942. 942. Okay. What is the place value of 4? What is the place value of 4? Correct. It's tens. What about the place value of nine? What about the place value of nine? Correct. It's hundreds. What about the place value of two? What is the place value of two? You got it right. It's once. Very good, children. Do you know now how to use the place value chart? Very good. Bye. See you next time.